A very good evening and Om Shanti to all of you listeners. Welcome back to your own channel, Seek the Soul the Truth Lies Within. It's a channel on YouTube and where we talk about blessings which make us powerful on a daily basis. These are godly blessings which help us to think right, to act right and to speak right. So let us see what does Baba have to talk about in today's blessing. Godfather. Godfather says in the title, may you be simple, may you be simple and become a sample and reveal your greatness through your ordinariness. So if you are an ordinary person, if you have ordinary expectations, if you have ordinary simple desires, then you become somebody who is great. So let's get into the explanation part. When a simple thing is clean, a simple thing is clean, it definitely attracts you to itself. A very simple thing may help you to do much more than a very complicated thing. For example, people use a chopping board and a knife to cut ginger, but then you have ginger cutters which are coming in the form of machinery or in the form of clenching and squeezing the ginger or cutting it into different forms in different shapes and sizes there's so many different kinds of tools which are available online nowadays now either you cut it on a chopping board with a simple knife or you buy those tools sometimes those tools become very complicated and you might not be able to cut the ginger properly just for an example or it could be any fruit or it could be any other thing so it could be any other chopping machinery so God says simply over here that when a simple thing is clean, it definitely attracts you to itself. That means you tend to go for simpler things in life than the complicated things in life. So in the same way, in terms of the thoughts of your mind, what should we choose? Complicated thoughts or simple thoughts? With your relations, when we come in relations with people, certain times we tend to be too complicated, certain times we tend to be too stubborn. I want it this way, I want to eat this way, I like this kind of food, I like to sleep on this kind of bed, I want these facilities, if I don't get them, I won't be happy. So that's about relationships, what kind of people we sometimes we can't even, we can't even have a normal conversation with every kind of person, it becomes difficult for us to relate to people because we have got complications within us. So building up relationships also becomes difficult. It could be lack of self-confidence, lack of lack of any form of experience in relationships which will also make somebody feel little not simple but complicated so with your interactions how do you interact with people either you have a complicated way of interacting with people or you are a simple person who has no knots within their own mind of complications no knots in their own feelings of complications so with them you can interact about anything and everything and with your way of living so let's say a guest comes to your house and they have their own desires they have their own ways of living and eating and sleeping and when they, you are not able to provide those kind of facilities to them they complain they talk about how it was better in their own home or how it was better in somebody else's home and they compare they complain so that kind of person is also obviously somebody who is not simple and who doesn't have a clean and clear mind and heart. Obviously, that kind of person won't be attractive to you, right? So Baba says, when you are simple and clean, on the contrary, when you are simple and clean, that means you have a simple way of thinking. When you come in contact with relationships, you are simple, you don't have any manipulation in your mind, you don't have any desires from them or you don't want anything from them or you don't want them to change for you. Or when you interact with them you don't count your words or you don't manipulate your words you don't use words so as to get something out of them and your way of living is also simple whatsoever facilities are there you are content with them and you don't have so many desires that somebody is not able to make you content or happy in whatsoever they do so you're a simple person so Baba says, when you are simple and clean, you become a sample and automatically attract others to yourself. 
simple means ordinary so you just like the tool for cutting the ginger is complicated whereas the knife and the board is simple so either you're complicated or you're simple if you're complicated you're an unattractive personality if you are simple if you're a simple person then you're not, you're an attractive personality but along with simple you have to be clean hearted person also so simple means ordinary ordinary means somebody who doesn't have huge desires or doesn't like to try anything and everything in life but is content with whatever basic they have they're not looking for the golden spoon they are okay even with a wooden spoon in their hand or a steel spoon in their hand they don't have such huge desires that people are not able to make them content so you have ordinary living ordinary way of talking ordinary way of simple and ordinary way of building up relationships and then baba says that is greatness so greatness is revealed through your ordinariness if you are an ordinary person your ordinariness is an example of greatness whereas we think that more we hold in our life the more different appliances we have in our life the more complicated way of living we have in our life the more we are attractive because it says people get tired of that after some time so the more ordinary you are you are able to communicate with each and every person you are able to build relationships with each and every person because you are simple nobody needs to please you nobody needs to nobody needs to make you over happy so as to be your friend or your relative or in be in relationship with you then you are easy to live with and you're simple so you have greatness in you those who are not ordinary that is not simple become a problem obviously think about that guest who complains about everything who compares about when they were in so and so place they were more comfortable whereas when they are in your house they are not comfortable how would that person make you feel would you want that person to be around you or would you want that guest to go away quickly could be your relative also could be your friend also so what kind of person what kind of personality are you are you simple or you are not and if you want to become simple then we learn the spiritual ways at brahma kumari's godly spiritual university where you can come and learn this beautiful knowledge for free it could be somewhere next door to you itself in your own city have a blessed good night om shanti